Howdy folks, Steampunk Desperado here. Today, instead of a review, I have a brief retrospective of an amazing project by Mrs. Desperado. It stars a plucky little alien that she picked up on discount from a former place of employment. He's 26 inches high, and he's a very helpful fellow since he has a tray to hold things for you. At some point, the missus decided that it would be fun to dress him up since he doesn't come with any clothes, poor guy. And so she started putting together costumes for him and taking photographs. Of course, there's no point in taking photographs if there's nobody to see them. Thus was born the Instagram channel Interstellar Fashion. Alien has modeled lots of different costumes appearing from weekly to monthly, often with jokes or wise sayings accompanying his photographs. He has acquired quite a following and was even featured as a guest of honor at a local science fiction convention. You've seen him on the title cards for several of my videos. So, without further ado, here he is, Interstellar Fashion! Meet Alien, our mysterious visitor from planet Brookstone. He's sophisticated and talented. His favorite activity is to celebrate all big holidays and the little ones as well. And being a fashionista, he always looks fabulous. He enjoys the holiday season as well as summertime. He has a romantic side. And of course, being discriminating, he loves steampunk. Sometimes he goes incognito. And nonetheless, he comes back blazing like fireworks. Here he is celebrating the new year. He's been around for several of those. Once again, baby alien new year. See, he's had a while to perfect his party technique. He brings his little green friends along sometimes. And he indulges his goofier side. He speaks many languages, including Spanish. And sometimes he doesn't know what holiday it is. Or what century it is. But, he's always fun. Here he is in his Russian phase celebrating his actual alien royal blood. With a human admirer. Homesick for his planet Brookstone, poor guy. But nonetheless, he's the chipper, cheery alien we love. Here he is at the sci-fi convention. Guest of honor. He loves our four-legged friends, especially cows. Now, he can be pretty intimidating in time, pretty scary, but he's safe enough to host your kid's birthday party. He has all the themes that kitties love, especially dinosaurs. Here he is being multicultural, <laughs> multi-species, and multi-talented. But he's a lover, not a fighter, so you don't have to worry about alien attacks or anything like that. Uh-oh, he got into a big scrape here. Will he survive? Yes, he survived, and here he is giving the interview to tell everybody about it. And here he is celebrating his survival. Enjoying the outdoors and communing with nature. Being pensive. And helping out the community. Keeping clean. And being patriotic to his adopted country. He likes to chill, so he has to stay in shape, so it looks good. But he likes junk food once in a while. Here he is, uh, celebrating American history and American cuisine. The very good American cuisine. Yes, seriously.
he can be fabulous and patriotic at the same time. Make outer space great again. His favorite friend, the jackalope. And, again, his sensitive, to sensitive side. Who's this guy? I seem to rec recognize this guy. And is this a ballerina or a ninja? I'm not sure. The name is Alien. Just Alien. Double O Infinity. We all want to believe Alien. And... Who's that man behind the mask? It's pretty scary sometimes being an alien on a strange planet. Sometimes he has to hide out under the sea. But he comes back as a hero. Pop, pow! Alien in his many moods. And he likes Firefly. Alien and his creator. Goodbye, alien. We'll miss you. Come back soon. He only has been absent for the last few years, but we understand he's been keeping quite busy, currently serving as fashion consultant for Area 51. Hope you enjoyed this retrospective of interstellar fashion. Let us know what you think about him in the comments below. Please like and subscribe. That helps us get out the good steampunk and science fiction word. For now, this is the Steampunk Desperado saying, Adios amigos, from the Steampunk Desperado channel, where the past meets the future, and the present is extraordinary.